All right. It says we're okay, but it also says unstable. <laughs> I, I'm i sorry, I've been having so many technical issues tonight. Like, I, nothing's working right. I, I don't know why, like, it still says that the stream is unstable. I don't know why it says that. I don't know. I Maybe I am needing to do some updates or something. I'm not sure what is going on. It's really weird. Oh, it says the bitrate is still too high. Yeah, that is really weird. Hold on, let me try to... Let me try to bring this down a little bit. Does that help, maybe? Hold on just a second. I'm gonna uh, look at this a little bit more. <laughs> uh, is, this, is this still having a problem? Okay, okay. It says excellent now. It said like in like this little like that little stream health window. It was saying that it was unstable. Um. I, I'm also making content for YouTube right now, so I am trying to do, um, like, Minecraft Let's Play stuff over on YouTube and just kind of creating some, like, ambient content that people can listen to in the background. And, uh, so for recording offline for that, like, I am trying to use some different recording settings so that the, the footage comes out like clearer um i think for like the the stream vods going straight to youtube i i don't really care that those are condensed um it is not really that that critical but like for the the stuff that i'm creating specifically for youtube like i'm trying to get the quality up there a little higher but um it apparently obs does not let you have like actual different settings for recording because doing that over the last like two weeks when I returned to streaming like it threw everything in my my stuff like off so I, I might simplify like I think I'm probably gonna end up redoing like my entire layout and stuff after this because um, I need to have like probably a simpler setup so that I can get back and forth between the two I don't know if I can have different installations. That's a really fantastic idea, though, to, like, look into. Um, I wonder if I can, if I can have different versions. Because, yeah, I was trying to do, uh, like, different scene collections. Um, like, install it in two different folders. I have not, I had not heard of that, but I am definitely going to try that. Because I had all of this set up, um, I was thinking also that, um, that maybe I could, like, even stream just the Minecraft content to YouTube. Because I wanted to do that without voice, without camera, so just, just Minecraft, just music. Um, so it was a completely different type of like content than just like uh, the let's the, the play like gameplay and interaction with chat and um, but it was like you you cannot have different settings in one instance of OBS. There's you can have different scene layouts, 
and you can have different settings within those scenes but beyond that like the connectivity or like your main settings you cannot have different profiles for that i haven't i haven't found a way to do it and it's really uh very annoying so yeah i'm gonna try to do another install of obs that i can use specifically for recording video um because that was another thing too for for this other thing for doing the the ambient scene type stuff that I want wanted to do on YouTube. Um, the uh, the like current recording settings that I have just like it it doesn't look very it's not very good quality and so it doesn't when you get it like up on like a big TV which is what I I wanted that content intended for like I want to be able people to be able to like. Put it on a TV in their living room to like create an, a, a space or a mood or something like that, and I um, and so like I want I want those videos to to look nice and crisp, like for that, and be able to run like really pretty Minecraft skins and things like that for it. So you know people that run two copies of OBS, one for recording the gameplay and one to stream to Twitch, so it should be an option. Okay. I, oh my god, I really appreciate that because, uh, it, I, I've, I am new to, like, doing the video recording and editing, and, um, but I'm really fascinated by it and interested in it right now, and I, I'm trying to learn it. I have been working with, like, DaVinci Resolve and trying to learn that program. It's a really, really awesome free, uh, resource, and, uh, so I want to do more with it. But yeah, I've been running into a snag after snag after snag with OBS. So I am I'm totally gonna try having two instances um installed because I think that that because I'm never doing both twice, like or, or at the same time, you know, I don't um Okay, you've done that but haven't touched it. Yeah, like just to have one specifically for like recording YouTube offline. Uh, that I am then editing and then uploading from DaVinci that would be fine that I just had all of like the, the higher recording settings um, that way I don't run into like any bitrate or whatever issues with um, with Twitch but yeah I <laughs> when I first started to stream um, I had like went back into the scene collection that was that I have set up for Twitch and I tried to stream and because I had set up another scene collection for YouTube and was just trying to test the waters on like if if like streaming to YouTube made sense, which it didn't and I ended up not even using that. Just uh, recording the video offline is probably going to be what I do. I, I don't know. I have to kind of look further into those options. But um, but when I went back to the Twitch stuff, I, I didn't even know that it w that they had bumped all of this out until I tried to go live. So it was like eight o'clock. My stream is supposed to start, and I hit like start streaming because I think I'm ready. <laughs> and it's like I don't know what you're talking about. There's no stream information in here. And I go into the the stream thing, and it's like the Twitch information's totally gone. It just bumped all of that out, and like. <laughs> So OBS doesn't know what I'm trying to do. <laughs> so I had to reconnect Twitch and then I got it reconnected and it had like totally reset my mic and like headset settings. And so it, that like Windows like freaked out with that and Windows was like, I don't know what this is anymore. And I'm like, it was the same as it was last week. Come on. <laughs> so I had to like reconnect that all too. It was so stupid. Um, but man. I don't know. It's okay though. I think like I always when stuff like this happens, I always like think back to like we used to always tell each other that it wasn't an official live stream unless there was a technical issue. Um, yeah, yeah. Thank you, thank you. I, I am too because it's really frustrating when like an audio won't work and you're like you're looking at the settings and like the stuff is in there and it's just not doing what you expect it to do. It's like ah, oh, it makes me want to pull out all my hair. Yeah, they do. They do. It's always like a learning experience too, and it there's like little ideas and stuff that come up from it. So yeah, it, it works out. Um, but yeah, it was just like it was really silly. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna start doing this night schedule because I think this is actually working better for me than to try to do the daytime ones. So um, I want to try to do like twice a week and do 
just start at like eight o'clock on my days off, which is Monday and Tuesday. So I have, I don't have that really anything going on in those days, but then I can do stuff like during the day, do recording projects during the day and still have time to kind of like relax, do yard work if I need to, those kinds of things. And like do just a couple of hours in the evening and, and not, I don't, I don't think I'm going to get back into doing like the six, seven, eight hour streams like I was doing because that, that that is just like not, I don't think that's a sustainable life for me. Like not when you're working a full-time job. <laughs> I don't think, uh, may, you know, like later, I, I think if, uh, if this is, if this is paying bills, then I'll stream longer. But if it's not, then I'm going to make it like, <laughs> it, it's got to be at an enjoyable level. <laughs> All right, you have to head out. Um, it's super t burned today. My energy is wiped out, but so glad uh, you're getting a schedule down and happy. It's going to be nighttime because that means I'll be able to raid you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was another thing, too, because um, I am trying to be active in the community again. So there are a, it, your stream there. Um, there's, a you know, other people that I want to, like, be a part of their communities during the day and I usually am when I'm working and so if I'm streaming on my days off during the day then I'm missing like those other streams and so uh, I thought like also like if I'm streaming at night I'm not missing out on streams and then like yeah hopefully like you know you and like some of my other friends like you guys are able to maybe join me in the evening so yeah that that makes me happy that you're able to come it's easier for you to get over here like during the during the day and then or during the evening so then likewise like I can I can pop in on your streams like during the day so that that works out really well but I hope you have a good evening thank you for stopping by and thank you for helping me you're always like so so helpful with all of this like the technical things <laughs> but I appreciate you Ping on Discord. Okay. All right. Yeah. If I have any questions, I'll I'll hit you up. Yeah. It's I, I'm relearning everything all over again. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. You you're awesome. All right. Thank you. Yeah. You have a good evening. Good night. Sleep well. <laughs> I will see you next time. Okay, let's resume. So we have double poison on this. So I think what we're gonna do is let's do let's do a wedding. And then someone passes. and she is sad too. And then we end it with Lenora also drinking water. Wow, our extra credit on this is someone drinking poison twice and we only have six frames to do that. That's interesting. So we're going to have to have 
have Isabel getting married. Isabel has a fight. don't have the the death scene on this one so we can't create heartbreak with that well maybe Poisons. Oh, there's a wine on the table now. Oh. Oh. Oh no. And then Isabel remarries. That in. That's funny. Okay, <laughs> now let's do a wedding. <laughs> okay. Is that the end? All right. I'm gonna do one more, and then I'm gonna call it a night. 
and um, I have no idea how much Twitch recorded of this stream. So depending on how much it is, how much it did, we might actually restart this game. Um, maybe, maybe next week. I don't know. Um, or, or I might, we might record some of it offline, maybe for YouTube. Um, but yeah, uh, this has uh, been really cute so far. Isabel commits a crime. Okay, we have practice in the other one for this. So, we have a wedding. And let's say that Edgar and Lenora are in love. But Isabel wants to marry Edgar. She is very upset that they cannot do that. So. Isabel decides that she will poison Lenora. And poor unsuspecting Lenora drinks the wine. She is so sad. And then... And then... Um... also drinks the wine. <laughs> uh, oh, but he doesn't meet a demise. Rejection there for a motive. Both of them that time. Oh. oh, okay, I'm getting much better at this. <laughs>
Okay. Alright, I know we haven't been live for that long. Um, oh, we had li lots and lots of technical difficulties this time. Um, I have actually been at this for a few hours. So, uh, I'm going to call it a night. And I am going to try to try to work on everything and uh, redo some stuff tomorrow before we go live again because uh, a lot of these settings I guess need to need to be redone uh, so I will try to do that and I will see all of you tomorrow for Nino Kuni tomorrow tomorrow um, we will get back into that and uh, kill some beasties help cat kings all of that kind of stuff so yeah um i hope you all have a really great evening um thanks for bearing with me through uh technical difficulties a uh, huge shout out to mansuris mail for uh giving me an idea of installing a second instance of obs for recording so maybe that will uh help prevent the technical issues that I had today with trying to do some different projects. Um, but yeah, I hope everybody has a fantastic evening and I will see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye.